If you're looking for 30 grams of protein at your breakfast, I've got the thing for you, plus it has 15 grams of fiber. We all know what happens with high protein meals, constipation. So you need a little fiber. It's 30 grams of protein from regular foods. So no ultra processed foods here, just whole foods with 30 grams of protein and 15 grams of fiber. I'm Tedez, I'm a registered dietitian and I have a food science degree. So a lot of food stuff going on. Let me show you. You can do it in a smoothie format, okay? Or you can just do it in a bowl. I'm gonna do it in a bowl because I just like it like that. Yogurt, skier yogurt, three quarters of a cup. So this is giving you 16 grams of protein from, I have Siggy's banana flavored yogurt, 2% milk fat, and it's 16 grams of protein. So that's going in the bowl and it's three quarters of a cup. You can use less if you want, but then you'll have a little less protein. So I've got that, a third of a cup of cottage cheese, and I'm gonna add two tablespoons of egg whites. So egg whites, you're gonna use raw egg whites. You can eat them raw from the container. Don't eat it from the egg itself. You're just increasing your risk of foodborne illness. You may get it, you may not, never know. But these things are pasteurized, so you can eat these raw. So I'm gonna add two tablespoons of egg whites to my cottage cheese. Now I'm gonna tell you what. So that is giving you 12 grams of protein. The cottage cheese is giving you another, I think it's 12 grams of protein. So I'm putting it in here because the egg whites, if you whip it together, okay, if you shake it, it becomes like a whipped. So it takes two seconds, you just shake it like that. So there you go. And then the eggs are nice and whipped. See the texture, nice and easy. So you add that, see? Perfect. Then I'm going to add one tablespoon of pumpkin seeds. Okay, that's another six grams of protein and healthy fats as well, which I really want you to get. Then a third of a cup of bran buds. So that is giving you 12 grams of fiber right there. And then I'm gonna add a third of a cup of berries. So raspberries, blackberries, you can do any berries. I'm using frozen, but you could also use fresh if you want it. I'm gonna add those in there. You can microwave them a little bit just to soften them, but I'm just gonna leave them cold because I like them cold. So then, here you go, see? So this is a breakfast bowl, which has, again, over 30 grams of protein, 15 grams of fiber, a lot of really nice antioxidants. So there you go. Follow for more.